Hello everyone, Sir Wex here of iSchool Corps and welcome back to Educ Nation. A couple of days ago, I posted a video on our Facebook page, link in the description below, where I showed a preview on how to easily print certificates and diplomas by the end of the school year using our ISF Certificate Generator version 3.1. And as promised, I am now distributing the template for free with a video tutorial on how to use it. But before we proceed, please subscribe here in our YouTube channel and don't forget to click on that bell icon to receive notifications on our latest uploads. Hit that like button and share our video to your co-teachers as well. Step 1. Download the zip file which is available in the description box below. Extract the files anywhere in your computer using the password iSchoolForms. I have mine extracted here on my desktop. Step 2. Open the ISF Certificate Generator folder and go to the Certificate Fonts folder. These are the required fonts for your certificate or diploma as stipulated in Depend Order No. 31 Series of 2019, also known as the Department of Education Service Marks and Visual Identity Manual of 2019. Double click on each font and click on the install button in the upper left of the window. Once the font is installed, this button will be grayed out. Do this process for both fonts. Step 3. Open the ISF Certificate Generator. For this demonstration, I will be using the generator for the elementary level. As a security measure, Microsoft Excel will warn you about files from the internet. Click on Enable Content and Enable Editing as prompted. As you can see, there are four worksheets available in the Certificate Generator. The welcome sheet will be the first one you'd see as a short background about this file in our organization. Start by clicking on the orange button that says, click here to start to paste your LIS SF5 to our generator. Step 4. Open your school form 5 which you downloaded from the LIS. Highlight everything by pressing Ctrl A on your keyboard and press Ctrl C to copy. Paste all of these in your school form 5 copy sheet by pressing Ctrl V on your keyboard. You can now choose to close your LIS school form 5 since you won't be needing it anymore. Step 5. Go to the data sheet of our template. This sheet will generate the data available from the LIS school form 5 which you transferred to our copy sheet a while ago. On the left side, you will see the school information details. In the division data, there is a blank cell. You will need to type the Filipino or Tagalog translation of your school's division office. Further below it is the date of signing details to be provided in your certificate or diploma. A drop-down list is provided for you so you don't need to type anything. Again, in the location of signing, provide its translation to Filipino. If any of these data are inaccurate, you can choose to edit it manually. Finally, Provide the data for your school head's name and your school's division superintendents. In the right side, a list of auto-generated names of students are shown. These are the students who were able to meet the desired expectations of your grade level. Learners who were marked retained or conditionally promoted in your SF5 will not be available here. Again, if any of these names are inaccurate in terms of spelling or arrangement, you can easily edit it. If none, you're ready to print your certificates by pressing the Go to Diploma Template button. Step 6. Replace the logo of your certificate with your respective division logo. Right-click on it, choose Change Picture, and click on From a File. Browse your desired logo, click on it, and choose Insert. On the upper right, the template tells you how many diplomas are available for printing based on your school form 5. There are three available buttons. The Print Diplomas button will automatically print the names of your learners. The View Data Sheet button will redirect you back to the data sheet. And the Clear Diploma Sheet to erase any generated data from the Print Diplomas button. For example, you only wish to print one learner. You can choose the learner's name here in the first record to print drop-down list. The template also has a status window to tell you which student you are printing and the desired page layout of your certificate. If you're ready, click on the Print Diplomas button. The template will automatically generate the data of this learner and open a Print Preview button. If you're satisfied with the output, 
you can now click on print. If you wish to print three students only, you can do that by clicking the name of the first student here and the last name of the student here. The status will remind you what you chose and you can now click on the print button. The print preview window will show you the generated certificates. Now you can just choose to print it or cancel it. And of course, if you want to print it all, you can do that by choosing the first name of the student in our list and the last student's name in the last record to print. If you wish to refresh or reset the template, you can just click on the clear diploma sheet button. And that's it! This is our ISF Certificate Generator version 3.1. If you have any questions, comments or reaction, just post it below. This is Sir Wes of High School Forms and thank you for watching.